Welcome to a new casted game. In this game, we have Coley versus Flea. <laughs> Here on the west side, we have Coley playing as Jean d'Arc. And on the east side, we have Flea, also known as Palladian, playing as the Ayubits. And Palladian is actually one of our friends, right, Nim? Yeah. Hi, that's your... You yeah, didn't you know? Think? No, I, I did, but the viewers don't know. Right? Oh, <laughs> and like I just thought, I thought you were asking me for confirmation on it. It's like, like you, you, you don't know. I, I mean, you know. No, I'm kidding. Sorry. No, I, I'm pretty sure he's our friend. <laughs> uh, so we love to give him some tips in this matchup. If you're wondering what rank or, this is, or just, or just, you know, uh, look, look at his. Magnify his mistakes mm -hmm. and 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 make a little bit of fun of it. Yeah, we always joke around a bit with Palladian, so yeah, you know he's used to it by now. <laughs> yeah, if you're wondering what rank this is, um, Cole, Coley or Coley is currently placed platinum. Palladian uh, has been gold and platinum before, but is unranked at the moment, so it's gold slash platinum. Yeah, that's about the um, the the range of of this this match here. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah, we see. Um, a Sorry, like I like when oh, I I just it's sneeze. It's a dramatic pause. It's I, a dramatic I, pause. It's fun. I I sneeze before this, and when I've when I've sneezed, my voice is always a little bit hoarse. Like mm. my throat is just really hoarse. And uh, yeah, we <clears> had a little <throat> break, and you know, we did some yeah. sneezing, we did some eating. Sorry. And I and for some reason lately, I just get things stuck in my throat as well. So I've got this thing stru stuck in my throat, and, <coughs> and Nim's got a sneezing thing going on. So yeah, it's, no, it's not sneezing. <laughs> it's just like my my throat is just oh, it's so because so of the wrong. sneezing, right? Okay, so we've got Coley coming out onto the deer already. Mm -hmm. um, I uh, I think I like this probably. Yeah, why not? Yeah, having Sean kill all the deer. Quickly, <laughs> so th it doesn't offer her any experience. Mm -hmm. um, it, but it, it used speed, to I at guess. some point, but mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> I'm so sorry about this. Yeah, we see Palladian going to scouting. Got quite some sheep already. Let's see his scouting path. Okay, so he went for via the edge first, which is usually where most sheep are located. Yeah. No, this this looks good to me. This uh, looks good to me. He wants to be back in time before his sheep run out, so it makes there's, sense. There's to go no back chance now. that Coli will have had a lot of sheep like this. No, no, definitely because Palladian already took the route. Yeah, we we mentioned this in another video as well, I think. But like the, the sheep are here, mm -hmm. the sheep are here. This yep. is where you want to be. Definitely. So, oh yeah, look at that. That's 10 sheep, 11 now. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of sheep. And I'm not sure if he already picked the ones up around his town center, but we will see Co Coli walking around. I mean, not not a bad amount of sheep for Coli. I think a, a piece of five, I'd say. Five, right, but it's okay. it's half of, of what, what uh, Plea has here. And I didn't even fall asleep. There's one more over there, but um, that's okay. Because <laughs> you're counting them, you're counting sheep? Yeah, 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 yeah. I was counting them. Yeah, 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 I got you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we are in a state that we need to explain the jokes. <laughs> got it, got it. I trust I trust our viewers' intelligence, though. Skull Cavalry coming up with five villagers. This is unusual for mm -hmm. for a Jean play to have that many yeah. on the the age of because Especially typically Jean is going to get XP from <clears> this, <throat> right? Yeah, she gets XP just like the longer she's spending on it. So that's mm -hmm. that's why you get a lot of XP from from building like a lot more than just gathering resources. Mm -hmm. So that's that's why. <clears throat> yeah, that's I'm, why Jean alone or maybe with another villager is going to be easier for her to get the XP. So you'll be a little bit slower on the age up, but you will be quicker at age, like leveling up Sean. So it's going to be more of a benefit like that. Yep. It's uh, it's the three villagers and orchards gain 50 additional food. I like that Palladian already has them queued on the berries. So he knows like they're going to spawn and they're immediately going to start working. So how does this work? Does that, does that like immediately add um, extra food right now? Because if it does, mm -hmm. it does. So what you want to do is you want to split your villages so that you're not depleting a single bush. Yep, 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 yep. That's that's the strat. I, I I talked to you about like videos oh. ago, but it was I thought it now was like I got it. Yeah, it was just the uh, bits and I thought it was also um, the Addison. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now I completely understand what you're talking about. Because like I've 
I'll, I'll be honest, I don't really play the Yubits all that much. Mm -hmm. But I looked at it and I was like, it's on orchards? Okay, so it should be on like on each one of these, mm -hmm. right? But then you don't want to deplete any of the berry bushes. You nope. just want to spread them out over yep. the berry bushes because you're going to get... Like this is this is a hundred extra food that that was that's Basi gone. Yeah, basically. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Palladian actually scouting out what's gonna happen and sees all those villagers in gold. There are quite some in gold, so yeah. I think he just missed the the knight already heading out his way, mm -hmm. but he does have the outpost on <clears throat> on his gold already and the barracks. Yeah, this oh yeah, he's, this is good. This looks so good. Mm -hmm. He already has that spearman ready for the knight that's gonna come in, and like to some some experienced players, right? And like maybe this looks, uh, this looks obvious that mm -hmm. you do this, but I I think for a lot of players it's not quite as obvious, right? Mm -hmm. I think it's so good to reinforce the the basics of making decisions like this. Yeah. And we do see the upgrade coming in for the spearman as well for Palladin. I think it is the hardened spearman, isn't it? Yeah, that's hardened spirit. We're we're on hardened spirit. I mean, I, there was, I think he's out here, right? Did I see? Hiding. He is hiding. Am I just imagining? You are things? imagining okay. him. He must be. There, there here must he be is. Tree. He must. <laughs> he must have. He must have found out how to teleport. Yeah, and Akoli came in with that fertilization upgrade, which is interesting for you. John Dark, I would say. I, it's it's not the one I typically grab first. No, because you kind of want to like go out on the map and grab some uh, some food from the map first. Wait, no, I mean it does help with that. It oh, does yeah. help with that. It how it helps with um, it does help with like berries. Mm -hmm. But not with deer. Not with deer, which is what he's on. Yeah, which is logical because that's a fast getter. And as creatures. John, you're typically going out and killing that mm -hmm. board too. Where is John actually? John is doing a shanting. <laughs> She's here as a peasant, but. Maybe coming out to kill this board? Is that the yeah. idea? What I've seen a lot of players do is just Oh, walk this is not going to go good. And then have Sean transform. Trans transform. <laughs> this is not going to go good. This is yeah, not going to go There is there is villagers going down. No, no. No. No, what did you No. So, we didn't have to give the enemy that ping. We could have moved in our archers over here. Mm -hmm. and then start attacking. Yeah, so we could have had, like, at least one, but we might have been able to get two even that one. Yeah. And all we need to do is, is really focus. But if you, as soon as you give your enemy that ping, right? Yeah, they're going to walk. The jig is up. Yeah, they, the they know what's up. going on. But we're, we're, we're recognizing we're, the fact that they are probably on the hunt, so that is great. Yeah, we're not leaving it there, but again, we need to yeah. move the arches in closer. Yeah, they're going to be able to pick off more villagers that way. Right, if if we move those over here, mm -hmm. right, we could have had two villagers for sure. Yep. So that's 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 twice now that um, our our bad micro cost is uh, some villager kills, mm -hmm. and this this is also not great. Yeah, we have three villager kills already on the side of Coley, and uh, just one for Palladian. Even though um, he was he was. It could have really been yeah. four for Palladian here yeah. already. I think so too. I'm not sure. This is uh I think we've talked about it like a last couple of games, right? But this is why you want the outpost to mm -hmm. not be um, towards your own base. You want it to be out of your own base. Yeah, so not, ne not necessarily next to the mining camp, but a little bit outward from it so that this can't con come down. This can't happen. Mm -hmm. And you cannot be denied in your gold vein. With, yeah, with because a, the with tower will be in the range of your tower and you just plop the villagers in as soon as they're trying to put them up. Yeah. The knight's going back. Oh, we see the battering. The battering ram out. did come down here. We've got uh, chivalry coming down for 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 Coley. It's the it's the upgrade for the the, the French knights that uh, helps them heal up out of combat. Sean moving into trying to kill that battering ram, and the villagers are coming forward. It's it a predictable been, turn of events, really. It would have been nice if if we could have shot at these villagers. When we're pulled back to ram, a naked ram is never gonna do achieve all that much. No, I think, I think Plea just moved over here his his villagers over to to food and wood instead, mm -hmm. and I like that. I like that. You don't need that gold. I think you got some upgrades in already. Mm -hmm. I like this, but this we're not gonna win this one. No. So what are we doing? We need to be pumping more of these, and how mm -hmm. do we do that? We need more production. 
Yeah, just we can better. really up the pace here if we just put, put down another one. Because yeah. how many are in here? Two. How many are in here? Five. Five. There's far too many, right? Yeah, there's, there's far too many. They're just waiting to come out. <laughs> okay, you're making a bettering ram at home. No, don't. That's good. Like bettering rams are gonna. It's, it's because he wants yeah. to get rid of this outpost, but it doesn't matter. No. It doesn't matter. This outpost doesn't matter. What matters is stopping your opponent from achieving what he wants to achieve. Mm -hmm. This isn't doing anything to you, unless you're like, oh well, I really want to go castle right now. But I don't feel like we have to. I don't feel like we have to. I think we could be very secure in mm -hmm. in uh, pushing the the French off of what they're doing. Mm -hmm. Shauna might be going down here. No, nah, I think she's gonna get away from, from, all, right. from all this. But she is quite low. I think it's a, it, we, it keeps happening that we put our arches at the far end mm -hmm. of of whatever uh, attack that we're doing instead of bringing them in closer to make sure that you can really pelt down the target that you want to pelt down. Mm -hmm. So there's there, there's a little bit of uh, feedback there, the, the oh. archer control. Yeah, we're also going after these knights, but we have no clue what's going to happen in the Jean d'Arc base. So which means there might be like 20, uh, 20 uh, knights standing there in the base and they're just running back. It's like, now this outpost is down, right? But are we on gold? No, because we don't want to be. Where's the scout? What? What's Why are we? Doing? <laughs> we're putting down so many houses. Is this for for a tier two? Mm, maybe. But I, just why don't we have another barracks or another archery mm -hmm. range? Like, there's so much. There's so much un underutilized mm -hmm. potential here. I yeah, think. I love to see the scout looking at like. Oh. Hey, what are, <laughs> yeah, these are those. Those are. Yeah, some we cute need ones. a new barracks. <laughs> I love to see the scout coming in to see like, hey, where can we do damage instead of like going in and trying to do damage? We can. Uh, try I think and your do scout is dead. No, it says one scout. Oh no, that's cool. Yeah, our scout is dead. Yeah, that's true. But we can make a new one. Scouting yeah. is important. Because if we, if we had not wasted our time over here, right? Mm -hmm. French wouldn't be castle right now. True. The French wouldn't be in castle right now. Oh, well, the villagers are gonna try and come for those rams. So and another another thing that you need to realize, I think, like when your enemy just aged up, mm -hmm. despite not being on the gold here, is they're on another gold. Yep. And it's probably not that well defended. So mm -hmm. just send out like two spearmen or two archers to to every gold in the neighborhood. To to the other golds, right? <laughs> to over here and over here. Yeah, that's that's Stop the importance that. of scouting, knowing where that is as well, right? It's not just yeah, yeah, because it's on is. your mini map. Mm -hmm. You don't you don't know that they're there, but you know that they're there. Yeah, you you can you can guesstimate that they're there. All right, so we do see our units going into the ram right now to be safe. Love to see them be popped out immediately when when the villagers coming out. We could defend this ram with with, with the units that are inside of it. Because it's gonna be a little harder for for them to like get those villagers out if they're gonna be killed. Yeah. Seven villagers kill, kills for Plea right now and three for Coley. So we see that Plea is gonna get, you know, uh, more, more, more villagers. More. In comparison. Put down more. <laughs> more bar all the barracks. We we want to go all in on this push. It, like if you if, if you think about it for a second, right? Mm -hmm. How much wood we've wasted on bettering rams that have gone down, mm -hmm. right? When each of those bettering rams could have been backed up by a greater number of forces mm -hmm. before really sending those bettering rams out. Yeah. Right? That is that is definitely enough wood mm -hmm. to, to make two more archer ranges. Poor guys, they just got sent in alone. That is that's sad. Now but the battery rings are gonna go alone. I love to see that the units are staying close to it. All right. Get us. Yeah, but like I feel like this is again like not enough, not this enough archers here. We're walking back and now. We're basically just giving them the chance to kill one of our battering rams. It's half our, our the battering rams HP again. It's because we're falling back. It's because we have units. so few archers. Mm -hmm. Then there they are again. We're just giving we're just giving you bettering rams by by retreating our army this like that. Just, there's just not enough forces here. That is the thing. Like we're if we're winning, but we're winning oh, very inelegantly. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think I think the uh, the the favor is is in uh, 
it, like this is going please way, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. But I, at the same time, it really oh, isn't. Out. But again, like we know that they're on gold, mm -hmm. right? Uh, and please should know as well because there are knights coming out. Uh, that's, that was somebody getting divine arrowed here. <laughs> Poor guy. Th th this male in particular, we hated apparently. Yeah, I mean, you know. We can like we can br definitely bring down a school of cavalry. Mm -hmm. That's that's one thing. You can do that safely and just have the archers not. Yes, have them send back, but not too far back. Apparently, the houses are more important. Um, well, there, I can tell you there are, there are a couple of victory conditions, and one of them is bring down all the. I landmarks. mean, I guess they're trying to house them, and mm -hmm. they 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 are su succeeding. Here. Definitely, yeah. But, but it's, it's a little easier to s fix the housing situation. Imagine if we had if we had come down here. Although our government is not really fixing it. Um. <laughs> Imagine if we had come down here and and, and, and here, right? Like. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. And now there's a bunch of man at arms because they're on gold because we mm -hmm. know that they're on gold because they aged up despite not being on this gold thing. Yeah. So we we're gonna need to find them, and it just it only takes like two two units to just be annoying there. You don't have to send your whole army over. And I, I feel I feel like this is much more. Um, like the French is making mistakes. Mm -hmm. The Jean player is making a lot of mistakes. Mm -hmm. And please underutilizing the amount of mistakes that that they're they're making. Mm -hmm. Right? You can really capitalize on them. Yep. Sending in units one by one right here. One sending. It's it's again like it's you such know? a small force of of units, mm -hmm. and we still haven't upped our our like we we have. We have wood. We have things in the bank. Then we can we can spend we, them. We we really should have gone double products at mm. any point right now. Yeah, we have quite some gold. We have a lot of gold. Um. Okay. We might not be spotting anything. I would love. Uh, I would have loved to see a new scout though. It's it's realizing like ah, okay yeah yeah. It's okay. realizing hey he must be on gold. It's a late realization, but we've realized it. Mm -hmm. Okay. We've realized spotted it. all those villagers there. And now and now. Sadly, they spotted a uh, Pelagian's army too, so they're gonna just be running. Okay. Going check, back check down. Berries. I mean, they're they're quite everywhere on the map right now, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Here we go. You're gonna you're gonna find some juicy and, villagers. And don't don't attack. No, you don't need a ram. You don't need a ram for this. The I mean, I think he wanted to just make a ram here and then accidentally found but his it, villagers. Yeah, yeah, but like it's it's still. Oh, okay, yeah, maybe that's the. That's <laughs> the but like these houses do not need to come. Like the villages need to die, right? That's, yeah, that's that's, that's what's gonna secure you the, you the victory. That's what's gonna make you mm -hmm. win this. If those villages are dead, right? There's no coming back for the for the French. Yeah, but you do see some naked battering rams coming in again. This is just wasted wood right now. I I wish we had. Um, actually, we do. We do. Uh, so we. This is the destruction value here. Yeah. And you can see um, that Coley destroyed so many of Palladian's things. Mm -hmm. This. It, this are units, but also definitely it's the battering rams. Mm -hmm. Just how much? Um, yeah, how, so ma how many resources are essentially just lost, just wasted mm -hmm. upon not getting a lot of value? Yeah, so in a way, Coley actually it's, is winning the we're fight. We're doing this again. Sending, yeah, we're not backing it up. We keep it, keep it behind then, you know, or uh, or destroy, don't make it. Destroy those uh, houses with them. They're no priority, but if you know if the amount anyway. of battering rams, like it's two hundred a piece, right? Two hundred, two hundred, two hundred, two hundred. If all of those had just been army, aren't they hundred fifty? Oh, two hundred. You, you're right. And this is going to go down again because, yeah, because he's going to pop this gonna out. Pull, yep. You know what the definition of madness is? Doing the same thing over and over and expecting to end differently. But then just slightly differently phrased. You, you, got, the, you got the essence of it, right? Yeah. At, at 200, 200, 200 wood. If all of mm -hmm. that had just been army, this game would be over. This game would be so, so over. I love right? how uh, Plea is going to go back to his goal to check it anyway. I mean, it's good. It's good. No, no, no. I like that. But That's what we're, still, like we're still on <laughs> three military production. Where mm -hmm. is the military production? Right? Are we trying to kill the French or are we not? 
Yeah. We sure are. What are we doing with all this gold? Mm, we don't need the gold. We didn't need the gold when we brought down this outpost, mm -hmm. and we sure as hell didn't need it now. We had the momentum, and we're losing it because... Mm -hmm. And I think I think at this point, please is saying, well, I just want to go cast at this mm -hmm. I don't really care about this anymore. I feel like... He Is feels like he needs crossbowmen, but he doesn't. Mm -hmm. He doesn't, because there are just... There are just four... I mean, there's a lot more men-at-arms now. We need now. to see this in cinematic mode, right? This is... This is a running ram. Look at us. Oh, Jean! Not Jean! Yeah, she's gonna go down. She's gonna go down. <laughs> But yeah. Like it, it, it looks like there's a lot of men at arms now. But mm -hmm. like, even though this isn't a lot, right? But we yeah. could have stopped this if we just pulled them off of gold early. If we, mm -hmm. if we realized what was going on here, how are they aging up when they don't have gold? Yeah, and they're just back on gold now. They're just back <laughs> on gold now. Twenty-four villagers on gold. That's quite a lot. But Palladium is also on gold with. Uh, oh no, that's sixteen. Uh, Palladium is on gold with twenty-four. Military. And now we feel like, hey, actually, we have a lot of un unused potential mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I really don't get why there's 24 on gold right now. Like, why are they not just on food and wood? Uh, I imagine we're making crossbowmen and we're making golems. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're getting raided. I mean, good thing on Kolai for like realizing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I because that's that's, that's definitely Kolai's ticket back into this game, mm -hmm. right? If he can even up the the villager count here. Yeah, especially because Palladian has been using a lot of his. Palladian resources. dropped the ball on on the aggression. Yeah. And now it's time to to harass his gold, mm -hmm. to harass his berries, to to take away his resources. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Plea is actually falling back right now. No, he's just chasing, chasing. Oh, chasing the, one, one guy. One yeah. man at arms. No, that is. And important. are the crossbow numbers here yet? I mean, we've got seven. seven. We've got more coming out. We've got four, five archery ranges, so that's good. We got another raid here on the wood line. He's he's stationed some spearmen, so that's very good. Yeah. Jean but this is back. this fight is, if if Jean can heal up, yes. yes. Big heal coming up. And the, the the riders for Jean are in as well. Mm -hmm. And these are really strong. These, these, need to, these are anti-ranged uh, units, right? Mm -hmm. So the these crossbows. need to be on the crossbows. Yeah. These need to be on the crossbows. Mm -hmm. Because are the, those are the ones tearing down his men at arms. His men at arms. Yeah, because the crossbows are anti-heavy armor and the men at arms are heavy armor. <laughs> Could you like I I love that um, so so many people forget to just use the divine mm -hmm. arrow. Yep. Right. They just let it stack up. Here. And it does so much damage. It does a lot of damage. Oh, there's the ram again. The ram is like, hello guys. <laughs> I don't think he's gonna be able to to win keep up this fight. What mm -hmm. I would love to see is for him to just split up the man at arms mm -hmm. and just. Wait, what? They tapped out? They tapped out? What? I think this no. game was not done yet. No, they weren't, I don't think they weren't losing yet. No, no, no I, this game was not done yet. Ooh, okay. If you want to see some more casted games, make sure to click on one of these playlists and make sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.